welcome back to Valheim. In the last episode, um, we built these berserker axes and made them thundering with an aeolite. I think what was it called? And in this episode, I'm gonna raid another castle with yet another new tactic that I did not find out myself. But um, oh, the oh trolls, where? Where? one over there I think it's only two in this event so it's fine hey there we go are there more coming I don't want there to be more ah oh, shit They'll destroy everything I have. At least it's a bunch of trolls though. There we go. And there's yet more coming. Jesus Christ. At least I don't do that much damage. These bumbling fools. And they don't seem to have an interest in my house, which is nice. For a change. There we go. I think there was six trolls. Or <laughs> I that's the first time I got this this um this invasion. I was scared for a second because I didn't remember what it was. How many coins did I get from that? Was that even worth it money wise? Oh, there's something laying here as well. Ah, a tail. Okay, 141 coins. So not even that worth it, but I guess it's fine. Good that these axes are very good at chopping wood. Though I do... I do think if I... If I'm not at home, I'll just continue using regular ones. I killed six trolls and got three trophies. That is quite good. But in this episode, we're gonna raid another castle, so let's just get right on that in just a second. So, of course, I haven't got a bow, which is not good. But I think I saw something here. Troll staff. Uh, I need 120 aether and use a 60% health. Uh, but what it does is summons a raging beast to cause death and destruction. So this thing uh, seemingly summons a troll. Which I hope I have three flam- Oh, Well then, that part of my tactic isn't gonna be useful. Still though, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna show you at a castle what I'm gonna do. So I think, like... Was it here? Was it at out- No. I think somewhere here is- I think there's like a castle here. Or a fortress or whatever. So let's go raid that. And hopefully it goes smoothly. Or at least not me dying. Oh damn. Quite good. But uh... Oh no. Little man. Hey. Oh shit, he, bl he blew up. Oh shit, oh, oh shit, oh, oh. This not good. Very not good. Okay. Ah. At least I do good damage, so... I just need to... Need to do well. Good. Very good indeed.
Mm. Don't like it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh damn. Twin. What the hell? What am I hurt by? Mm, I need to be careful. Very careful. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That works to me. Oh no. Oh shit. Now I'm royally done for, almost. Mm. No, no, no! No, I didn't, I wanted to jump. Okay, back I am again. It is raining. Hello, cat. There is a cat. Um, it's raining, which is nice. But I'm sure I'll be able to... Oh god damn it. Oh god damn it. Okay, good morning. And um... That was stupid. I forgot I don't... I don't float with the fe without the feather cape, so... But yeah, I made some more food. And also what I forgot to mention earlier is that between episodes I sailed to here and set up a portal. Ha <laughs> ha! How badly have my skills dropped? Oh, I think a few of these were higher before. Well, let's go get my stuff back now. Okay. Oh. Okay. What's the best way to get down here? Okay, some port shards. Okay. Now let's go get my stuff back. This one we'll just forget about, it never happened. But the one over here is pretty close, so... The enemy's hopefully gone away by now already as well. Oh! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Seems like I'm a bit protected though by my armor, which is good because then I can just I can just uh, whack them a bit. You see how it deals damage to both of them sometimes? I think that's the lightning effect, because otherwise it just does lightning damage. But I was here for a different purpose. I was here to find the Trout Fortress. Somewhere here, I assume. Since I did sleep recently, I should take this chance to just go to it. I do have enough weapons to beat it. So I will probably start leaving the mace at home soon. Okay, well that didn't work. But surely this big open... Well, hello. Ah, it's the same one. When they're alone, they're a lot easier to fight. Unsurprisingly. Okay. I need to up my axe skill just a bit. Oh, I thought I would kill it. No! <laughs> I never get the kill on them. Literally never. I've killed so many of those by now and not one of them with my own hands. There we go. Now was that so hard? 
Yes, it was. Come on, wasn't there a charred fortress in somewhere near here? There we go, there it is. Ah, my inventory is full already again. Of course, there's a Valkyrie nearby. And some Dwerger fighting a Morgan. I think I'll just see if I can find uh, a place without it. Of course, without my bow or an a siege weapon, I can't really do anything against the Skugs. But what I can do is set up a workbench here. And wait for that guy to come. Oh, he won't come close, so he's an archer. What I can do is set that up and then... Oh, how many... St ah, I forgot to bring stones. Right, I need stones to raise the ground. Well, guess I'll just quickly... That's Graustein, I need stone. Stone. Who dares? Who dares? I mean, if you didn't expect me to, to forget the thing I need to build up, then really do you even... Did you even watch my stuff? And by the way, yes, you cannot undermine these walls. They are literally to the to the lowest level you can go in this world. Oh well, to the lowest level anything can be. I checked in another world, I flew under the map and for some reason these things go all the way to the bottom until they reach ocean level. There we go, stone. I'll just wait for some stamina, because I will have to jump in here. Oh. Yeah, I was worried that would happen. I think I may have to go to just the good old siege weapon strategy. Ouch. I want to jump up there. Okay, I guess if, it, if I can't jump up that, s that wall, I will just... Get more stone. Have it your way, game. Why is it so laggy? I feel like the FPS have dropped by quite a bit. I don't have the flare metal for another siege weapon. That's why I did this strategy. I'll just go get more stone from home. Okay, I'm back now. I've brought along stones, but I forgot to empty out my inventory as expected of me and let's go in there now try to deal with them the hard way whoa 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 I can stand here okay that is hopefully high enough to jump. I will re-eat. Okay. Now I need to find a good angle to attack from. And I think it'll be that spawner there first. Along with that warlock. Oh shit! I could not see anything. That was stupid. Very stupid. Okay, so I'm back. It is getting dark and as you can see I brought along these smoke bombs though I'm starting to think that they may just be wastes of space. I will activate bone mass and just go get my stuff and be out of there. And try to do some damage on the way. Hopefully. Okay, nope. Didn't work. This time it did not. Luckily they aren't that good. 
Escape. Now they should all hopefully all be coming towards the location they know I'm at, which is here. Hopefully. And then I can go get my stuff quickly. Seeing that the smoke bombs I don't think did any damage, I'll just drop them. Rush back in, get my stuff, rush back out. Hopefully no trouble on the way. Okay, that is trouble. Troublesome. No. No. Well, okay, I um I fear I have no choice. Carapace armor, black metal weapons, lockscape. Not what I would choose voluntarily. But it'll have to do. I'll bring some of the oh no, some of these. I will eat fresh food after I go to sleep. And then I'll get my stuff back. So the plan is to hopefully uh, kill all of them and or at least most of them and then go get my stuff. Now, of course for that I need to first of all defeat all of them. Does that do damage to them? I can't tell. I don't know if they breathe. Smoked. So that's more of a player based weapon. Based against players I mean. Okay. Come on blob explode. Good, effigy again. I feel very slow. Hmm. I could check the chests to see if they have any flare metal, but for that I need to get them all out of the way first. Okay, the, wa the, the warlocks are both normal, so that's good at least. I haven't got the bone mass power, so that's not good. I'll just test it again. As you can see, it does nothing. Okay. But at least the spawner is gone. Maybe they throw away everything. Oh no, they're coming. No, 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 no. You stay away. Ha. Hiya. Hoa. I don't know. I don't think the smoke bombs are helping me in any way. It is so laggy. But I can't turn down the graphics anymore, I think. I have turned down the graphics a bit more just for this fight. Because if I can't see, I can't fight. Blind warriors rarely get anything done. All I need is. Ouch. But I'm not even fast enough to get to my stuff safely. Oh, this was the wrong one. That was bad. I saw an iolite, but nothing of use right now. If the warlock fire at least did damage to them as well, I'd be glad, but it does not. Not even a bit. The arrows do damage to the skugs, I think, which is nice. There's another chest there, but I need to free it first for to check it. Oh, for a second I thought I broke, or one of the skugs broke. But corpse runs still. Could have used that to attack had I noticed. 
I need those damned warlocks alone. But the only ones I could catch alone are the warriors. At least I haven't got any more skill drain while I tried this, so... I am safe in that regard. Is that a lone warrior? A uh, warlock, I mean. No, you die. Not again. Okay, what? For some reason I picked up only my meat platter earlier, or what was it? Mashed meat. Weird. Also got a bunch of itchy, s itchy bites on my leg that are, on my leg that are itching. But hey, at least I got some new food, and it's the food that will run out first. So, yippee. But I think now it's a f it's getting easier. Okay, not not like that. I sadly need to wait up here for my stamina to regen. Okay. Is there still two two warlocks? Ah, good. That is broken. Okay. Slowly but surely I'm doing something good. I can barely even locate the warlocks because they all look so similar. Not the same though, I'm not being racist. Okay, that's one skug remaining. And that chest is free and... Oh no! Only need ten. Okay. Got ten. Fly metal. Twelve even. Now how do I get that stuff? Oh, there was a warlock on the wall, but archers right in front of my axes. If only they came down here for a one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, I'll be back in just a second. Okay, so I think I have a chest here that's just full of hammers. Aha! Hammers, hammers everywhere. Good. Then what else do I need for the ram? 10 flare metal, 20 ash wood, I can make the flare metal. And I have the ash wood, I believe. 20 ash wood, I have that easily. And then two of these. Great. I'll make a battering ram. I'll ram down their gate. And then I will simply... Um, uh, I'll just lure them all out and then run around the walls of the thing once and then I'll go in, get my stuff and defeat them all. It's foolproof plan really. I just need my flare metal to be done first. And before anyone comments, I will not switch to magic just cause I, just cause I struggle a bit. Uh, cause the magic armor I saw takes a bunch of aether and I'm not prepared to collect a bunch of aether just cause I am struggling a bit right now. Cause like, you see aether? Embla, that also takes aether, yeah. 
Aether everywhere. Aether, Aether, Aether. I don't want to do that. I could... Ah. I could make one of these staffs, maybe. Um... How much Aether do I have, basic? Where do I see that? Um... Um... It doesn't show me anywhere how much Aether I have right now. And I don't want to eat an Aether food, so I guess I'm just not gonna know. Ah, oh, they just heard the tenth one. But first I gotta... Wait for that, because I had too many bones again. And when I have too many bones, I just obliterate them. Same, same with stone and such. Not with wood though, because wood you just burn that to coal. Let us go win. Okay, so the fallen Valkyrie is over there now, which is not quite better. Oh, hey. What, what, what? Okay. 21 in blocking. But the Valkyrie is on the bad place because I need to go... Oh no, there's a gate over there as well, I think. Never mind. So let's just do this dumbass plan I had. Let's see here. Break down the gate. Come on. Yep. About as I expected. Everyone is coming out. I activate this baby. And I run around them inside. I got what I wanted most now, which is the hoe and the stone. Because then I can lock them out. If I can make it out myself, if I can... Whoa. Why, what was I stuck on there? Nobody knows. Nobody ever knows. However, I need them to come... Around and around and around. This will work, I'm sure. Nobody here. Good. Okay. I'm in here alone with a Valkyrie, which isn't quite quite better but at least everyone is out can't just circle the tower a bit just gotta put on all the right gear slowly and then gotta get the right weaponry mainly berserker axes so I'll just collect all of them now, get this out of here, get this over here, get this over here, get this over here. Because now we're alone with it inside here. And what I do realize is that I'm gonna have to go out back out there at some point to grab my battering ram to open up this door. But I'll worry about that when I get to it. First, this thing needs to get its last hit. By me, hopefully, and not by the walls. No, you're dead! There we go. Finally a worthy kill for the lightning battle axes. Well, let's see here. Mm -hmm. Got quite a bunch of stuff here. Hmm... Did I collect everything? 
Well, I guess everything I had space for, there is... Flare metal here, yep. Um, I'll equip the Megan Yord again. I don't know why it was de-equipped in the first place, but... Jesus Christ, my cat just scared me. Cat on my lap. I'm afraid I may have to throw it off again. So I took all that I could. Um, let's just peek over the wall what, what I'm actually dealing with anymore. After this thing falls. Ah, the cat is wet because it's raining. Oh, hey. Well, we've got one more guy inside, but he's on the tower. Cat, stop. 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 Cat. One second. The cat has been removed. Peacefully, of course. Um, need some kind of way to get to there. Where my battering ram is. First of all, I've got to get the get the space and the weight to. I think I can just grab it. They were so kind as to break it for me. Oh no, it's here. Come on. Well, I guess I'll just kill them while they're so separated. They're all almost... they're all damaged. Even that one is mostly fine but still damaged. What happened here? Was there a brief civil war because they somehow got locked out of their own crib? I mean, I would be angry. Like, one of them surely forgot the keys inside, like... Though I guess can't ha can't do much of keys against a stone wall that's unbreakable but oh shit they're both in there come on energy no 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 oh not again so somewhere there two warlocks I think I see one of them I oh know that's a twit. That's the dudes. I need to get my stuff from them. I'll just rush it. Oh, they're they are in there. Ebi, ah, ah, no, let me jump. Let me jump up here correctly. Okay, that wasn't good. Wasn't too bad either. Come on up. Yes. Oh. Good, because this stuff here I can use. Good. No armor. But at least some things. Maybe I can have them walk away. Warlock. Maybe they'll just forget about me and go away. Just as that archer up there did. But I feel like they're just hovering around me. Really all I need to do is run in there, grab the stuff and go, but I think there's too much weight in that gravestone for me to just grab it. If anything, two runs are what I'd need. One for the Megan Yord, one for the other thing. But if they don't stop babbling around down there, what can I do? Pop this maybe. Fire resistance and run in and No not play stacks. Oh. Let's try this again. Let's try this again, I say. Yeah that worked. What a I really don't know how I'm gonna market this episode in any way because it's just me dying again and again and again. 
I made two stacks of food before this episode and they're both almost gone. Okay, finally, back up here. I'm not even gonna show how I got here because I was not amused. The warlocks are seemingly gone, which is a plus. So I just need a weapon to why to kill the guys. First I need to survive them though. Oh damn, that did good damage. You saw I caught. I killed all of them with one strike. Yeah, berserker axes, I say. Huh. I can finally. Oh, my helmet is broken. I'll take the most important things. Actually, let's just let's just get to a safe place and. I'll do the rest of what I would do between episodes, like getting all the stuff back home and smelting down the flame metal. But I did smelt down all of it now, so eh. I'll all, I'll break this down in the next episode. Sorry, but no energy left. Well, still, I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Valheim. If you did, then please also consider leaving a like and subscribing as well. Ring the bell to not miss any future uploads. And I will, as always, see you all in the next video. Bye-bye!